Today is the big day. Yay, my period's late. It's late. Because maybe it's freaking positive. Think positive. You this is such an emotional roller coaster ride, I'll tell you that. Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to a brand new video. Today is the big day. Today is the day that Larry and I head off to our fertility clinic and have our blood test to find out if we are pregnant or not. So we had our second IUI two weeks ago. Today is technically day 15 post ovulation and post IUI procedure. Um, it's currently 715. My blood test is at 815. And I would be somewhat lying if I said I wasn't nervous because, <laughs> but I did take two pregnancy tests, both were negative. Um, there is still a chance that the blood test might be able to tell more than the at-home pregnancy test. And let me tell you what caused me to take that test. So I had no idea. I should take these out, but somebody in the comments had told me that progesterone, which is the hormone that I have been taking, can cause your period to basically not arrive even if you're not pregnant. So this whole time I was thinking, oh yay, my period's late, it's late, it's late, so I've gotta be pregnant. Well, <laughs> that might not be the case. <laughs> I wish, I really wish, and I'm not blaming the doctors, I'm not blaming the pharmacy or anything like that, but it's just something I wish I would have known. I guess I should have done my own research on the internet, but I try not to research every ailment or side effects or drugs. I was already in the internet researching way more than I needed to be. And then I saw that and I started researching. So that was uh, Wednesday night and I jumped up and I decided, well, shoot, I'm going to take a test. And it was negative, which I did film. So I'll show it to you guys. And then I was like, well, it wasn't my first morning pee. So I'll wait until the next morning. Um, which was yesterday morning and it was also negative. So maybe, 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 but I am incredibly nervous because, well, you guys know why. I mean, that was the last of the donor vial that we had. We would have to start from square one, but let's stay positive. Let's not freak out yet. Um, let me play the footage here of me taking that first pregnancy test. Technically, my period is two days late. Oh man, you guys know the first one didn't work, or if you don't know, the first IUI procedure did not work. This is our second attempt, so. Oh my God, why am I doing this so early? I mean, it's not even early, but why am I doing this to myself? I don't know, because maybe it's positive. Because maybe it's freaking positive. Think positive, you bring about what you think about. We need two lines on this stick, y'all. We need two lines. We need two lines. So, oh, I've left my hair straightener on all day. OMG, it's bloody freaking hot. Are you kidding? This is result window facing up with the result window facing up. How long do I have to wait? Three minutes. Oh dear Jesus. Oh God, oh God, please, please. Three minutes is up. I have not looked yet. Let's say a prayer, first of all. Pray, praying, praying. Are you f Okay, now that you guys have seen that, I was a little upset obviously, um, but I don't want to lose hope. I don't want to lose faith. And let's hit the road. Let's go to the clinic. And it's going to be a long dreaded wait because they'll be calling me. At least I find out in the same day. Hopefully they will call. Then I'm not even finished getting ready. Larry's getting ready. Um, also woke up with the largest zit right there. What the heck is that? I don't get zits right there. That's weird. I get them all here, but not on my cheek. Very bizarre. Very much not fun. Part of me wishes I wouldn't have taken those tests. But then part of me wished maybe it was a good thing I did because if they call and say, hey, it's negative, oh my God. At least if it's negative, I already have an inkling that it might be. I prayed a lot. <laughs> I'm hoping that, I don't know. I don't know, let's go. I don't wanna ramble. That's gonna be a, a day. Maybe a good day, <laughs> maybe a celebration day. Hey Mink. How are you feeling? Okay. How are you feeling about the test? I'm uh, feeling good about the test. You are? I am. Even with? The last few days? Even with the last few days, because I'm gonna base 
their test as being better than an at home test. Yeah. Made it. The traffic was awful this morning. It was intense. We're almost home. And I just realized I've been traveling with a little late tea bug on my sleeve the entire time. On the way home, I look down and I'm like, my shirt's green. Why is there orange there? And it's a ladybug, a little baby ladybug. Larry and I just got back. I just used the restroom. I know, a little TMI, but I have started lightly brown spotting. So don't know if that's the period trying to come through. Don't know if that's, basically, I don't know what it is, but I had period cramps for like a week and a half. So if it is the progesterone preventing my period from happening, I should have started my period like over a week ago. So hopefully this isn't a rough one. Just checking in, but you guys know when you're waiting for a call and you just are like continuously looking at the thing. Uh, so I'm gonna distract myself. I'm gonna start editing this vlog that you guys are watching right now. And just kind of focus on that. I did just go to the bathroom again. I am still spotting. Picking out some music to listen to whilst I edit. Let's do Game of Thrones, shall we? Okay. has a rough job. That's not a phone call I would want to make. No. Did she say sometimes IUIs just don't work for people? Sometimes, but I think it'll work for you. I don't know why it didn't work this time. Especially when everything was perfect. Mm -hmm. I'm getting a really bad headache now. I'll get away from your computer. Go lay down. I don't want to. I think it'll be better to stay busy. So I'm supposed to call once I start my period? Mm -hmm. Well, my period's spotting now. <laughs> so that's like now. Well, I didn't, I couldn't think of that at the time. <laughs> Why? Those home stick tests aren't wrong, are they? No. They're not wrong. I knew it. Well, didn't know it up until two days ago. I wasn't expecting to cry, I already knew. <laughs> But there was that small little chance. Your head's cut off. <laughs> Say hi. Hello. Yay. Maybe it just was not meant to be with that donor. An aggressive, a more aggressive IUI. There's so much. Great. There's so much. Aggressive? <laughs> I thought all those medications were aggressive. Boo. Yeah, your mental pills and your pills and your self-inflicted shots and... Hmm. I didn't even cry like this when I saw my negative pee stick. I was more mad. Now I'm sad. Anyways, I'm just gonna edit now. I'm gonna finish this video. We're not pregnant! Now to try all over again. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for praying. There was people that were literally at church praying for us, you know. I guess in the next video or maybe the next video after that, after we talk to them, we'll explain more because right now I couldn't get the questions out. I got more out than I thought I was going to get out, but we'll talk about next steps and what we're supposed to do and now we've lost the donor that we were using so we have to find a new donor which is fine but that's the steps that we know so far i'm surprised they brought up ivf 
See, this is why you don't read the internet. She said, didn't she say something about the first IUI has just as good of a chance as your second and third? I think everyone is different. So, I think every situation is different. Every donor is different. It sucks when everything with your system is perfect and it still doesn't work. Like, better than perfect. Like, higher than average. And it still doesn't work. Anyways. <laughs> Ew, I don't like crying. Blech. Are you getting my blanket? <laughs> I don't have tissue, so I brought this instead. Toilet paper for my snot. <laughs> Thank you. Boo. Well, not what we were hoping for. And it's so sad that literally up until two days ago, I thought I was pregnant until I read that comment that said, progesterone can delay the period and trick your stinking body. This is such... An emotional roller coaster ride, I'll tell you that. But, and at first I was really angry a couple days ago and irritated. And why and why? And if you keep asking why, which I'm still doing, is why didn't it work when everything was perfect? Sometimes things are just not meant to be. Maybe this was God's way of saying that that donor and it just wasn't right. And maybe the timing wasn't right for whatever reason. I'm <laughs> sorry, Larry's head is cut off. But, for whatever reason, it just I just have to believe that it wasn't meant to be and God has a different plan. So, we'll keep trying because I don't want to give up yet. You don't want to give up yet, no. do you? No, 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 no. But, if you guys are going through it, don't give up. It sucks, though. Let me tell you. I know you guys probably know, too. And it's stinking. <laughs> sucks. But it's got to be worth it in the end. Yay can't wait for that day where I'm like <laughs> all right love you guys and I'll see you guys again very soon bye